songs. Hey y'all, what's going on? We're gonna jam, all right? So let's get in tune, open A. Just get your A, let's just check it. Let's just get it close. It doesn't need to be perfect. We're having fun today. You can check your, uh, your D. Too. It might sound a little funky in this key, but that's okay. And so uh, let's just play after me, okay? We're going to start open A. Let's just play that nice and relaxed. You play. Boom, boom, boom. A, G sharp, F sharp. twice for you, okay? So you have two chances. Starting on A. Now let's start on F sharp, okay? Them, them, 
now does that other part starting on A, A, C sharp. Party. Let's learn the bass line. Bass players in the house. Everybody playing the bass line. Shake it out, shake it out. All right, it's the morning. I don't know, for me, it's the morning. I don't usually get up that early. Y'all probably get up earlier than me. How y'all feeling? You feeling good? Having fun so far? Is it too easy? Is it too hard? Is it too exciting? Is it too boring? All right, show me this. This is your bow hold, right? Let's just get our bow hold out there. I know the bass players, you might have a different bow hold. Cello might have a different hold. Just get your bow hold out there. And... What we want to do, what I like to do, and I don't know, bass and cello, it may be different, and that's fine, but this pinky right here, you see, the tip of my pinky is on my bow, and if I push it, boom, just the pinky, all I'm doing is pushing the pinky. We get a windshield wiper. Can you do that? Just push your pinky. It's not the arm. Yeah, that's looking good. It's not, it's not this, right? No arm, no wrist, just pinky. Pinky push. Six inches. Pinky push. It's my favorite line from the movie Elf. Six inches. You ever see that? <laughs> Pinky push. All right, this is good. So, now, if we just throw that pinky up and just drop the bow on the string like this, and we let our... put First of all, okay, put your fingers, just let them fall on the instrument. Just let your fingers fall. Go ahead and hold your playing position. Cello playing position. Let's let your left hand fall on the instrument, but not pressing. Just fall, right? Now, if we drop the bow, windshield wiper, you don't get much of a sound, really. It's just a little drop. It's like a raindrop, right? But if you also let the drag the bow, then it kind of it kind of gets this, right? And I'm aiming for two strings. You can go low strings. You can go high strings. So it's windshield wiper and drag, right? And then what we can do with that, we just get that pocket. Just that beat. You can try to bounce it. I do this, although I don't recommend it, but I do that. You can also do this, right? Whatever. It's all good. <laughs> Just try to feel the rhythm. come back to that so one of the things I like to do when we put our fingers down our fingers down on the strings like this 
we can we can draw the bow lightly and we get this kind of ghosty sound this whoosh 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 can you get that just that kind of whoosh 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 sound so my bow is really light on the string and my fingers are just muting the strings they're just they're just they're not pressing but they're just muting it right so what i do is i experiment with getting some notes that sound and some notes that are muted and eventually i do a lot of funky stuff with this so let's see what i can do with it so check this out so i'm just going to demonstrate so if i wanted to uh um So you see how I'm doing that? The bow is moving like this, and some of the times I'm muting it. I can also do it like here if I want. And I'll put the wah-wah pedal on so you can see what this is like, you know? It's the same thing if I do it like this. Uh, 